coming into Duluth. Driving into Duluth. Sure is a pretty drive down this hill when you come in into Duluth. There's a Lake Street lift bridge. Check it out. Across the way there is Wisconsin. This is downtown Duluth. Okay, we're in two harbors. We're gonna stop at Castle Danger Brewery before we go to the Trussell Inn, which is by Crooked Lake in Superior National Forest. Just turned to gravel, and that's about the end of the paved roads up here. Once we get to where we're going, this is it'll be 25 miles of gravel road straight north um, to Crooked Lake, Lake Harriet. We're gonna hit Superior National Forest, and then once we get to where we are, it's like 40 minutes to Canada. There's like no roads that go up there though. Hi, dude. This is absolutely amazing. so many campsites up here I'm sure a lot of them are taken but if you just keep looking you'll find some here's a good look at this one it's all open fire pit picnic table there's an RV coming in right now there's a campsite right down there and we're to the right here which is the boat launch to the left here is like the whole lake is across here pretty awesome spot all right we got all set up well, we're getting set up the lake is right down there. We've got our tent set up, table, we put the picnic bench where we want it. We have our fire pit over there and there's blueberries in this patch over here. Um, hopefully we see some black bears. Hello. Addie's playing with all her Shopkins and LOL dolls. Hello, okay, good. So this should be good. We're going to do some fishing probably you get your water bottle? later. Yeah, they would look really good. Right. You're, you're not. And even it up. is blueberries growing everywhere. These are just small blueberries. I've never seen wild blueberries before. Oh my god. This is the launch. That's the awesome, actually pretty clean Biffy. 
And our campsite is right there. It's pretty awesome. Red Harriet Lake in Superior National Forest, yeah! So Actually, beautiful here. It's amazing. Look what we caught. A I little... had a bite. Look what it, look it was. <laughs> he wants my worm. He's trying to cut it in half. Let go, dude. How oh, funny. That's funny. That is funny. I've never seen that happen. <laughs> Addy, where are you driving us? Yeah. I'm just checking to see if the fish. Is there any down there? Um, looks like it, but I don't know where that one he got. You do it. Daddy asked for that so he could find a bull moose. Came out. We walked from the campsite to the gravel pit here. This is where we'd probably shoot guns. A great spot to shoot guns. Nice. Oh, I did it. You hit the 
of water. Good job. <laughs> Just a little error uh, pellet gun. I'm up at the Trestle Inn um, by Crooked Lake. This place is awesome. It's log heated by a fireplace in the wintertime. It's, this place is really cool. Um, it's got a bunch of patches from basically every police department. Um, they've been brought here. They've never been bought. So if you work for a police department, a fire station or something, they probably brought a patch up here to hang it up. Come check out the Trestle Inn. The Trestle Inn has a swing set and tetherball. How awesome. I just beat Addie at it. Crooked Lake Resort is just down this path. He didn't beat you, did he? I beat you at tetherball. No. Yes, I did. Foosball and Pac-Man. I love the old western style doors though. All the patches from basically every department there is like I was just saying. This place is pretty awesome. Okay, we're at Crooked Lake. This is cabin six. Let's check it out. They're rustic. They have no running water. They have the restrooms. Okay, they have their sink, which is no running water, stove, fridge, two beds. It's not really a separate bedroom. It's just like a split wall. It looks like a curtain there. View of the lake with the dock, everybody swimming. Super cool. This is campsite five. Guessing four. Three. Two. And one. This is Crooked Lake. It is awesome. This is Hogbacks Lake. It's a trout lake. Looks like it goes through that little channel right there. Here's the launch. Pretty good launch, actually. Really clear, of course, because it's a trout lake. Okay, I'm on Hogsback. There's lakes access right here. You could probably anchor out just a little bit. Um, hiking trail. It's pretty cool. I don't know where to tent, but there's a fishing dock to my to the left here. I saw a couple people fishing. There's one spot that somebody was in, but here's a campsite for hogs back. It's right across the lake here, or the road. Um, really clean.
done camping and we're at Gooseberry Falls on the way back in the North Shore that, can, that goes into Lake Superior. I'm going to show you a little montage of this place. This place is awesome. I recommend checking it out. <laughs>